Well, we're gathered here today to celebrate a new chapter with John and Kim. You've come here to share in this formal commitment they make to one another to offer your love and support to this union and to allow this couple to start their marriage together, surrounded by the people dearest to them. Memorize every color in your eyes, quiet universe inside. Um, since since we've been friends, it's like you've always been such a good example of how to grow along spiritual lines. I've known you for 12 years, and you've searched for the love that you have with John that entire time, someone that loves you just the way that you are. And I'm so grateful that you failed that. I'm proud of you, and I hope you can like just celebrate. This is like the Olympics, right? Like, <laughs> woo -hoo! And I love you so much, and I'm so happy that you found someone that accepts you the way you accept others. Yeah. I love you so much. Says Jackie, thank you for raising the man of my dreams. I will love him always. Love, Kim. Letters to my husband. I've waited and dreamt of this day for so long now, it's finally here. I can't wait to marry you, John Reeb. I can't wait to continue this beautiful life we have built together. I can't wait to see how handsome you look, I love you more than all the stars in the sky. I'll see you soon. XOXO, your wifey, Kim. We are freaking doing it. Woo! In my imagination, Wedding party. <laughs> I'm pretty happy to be here because I got a brother finally. No, the best brother I could ask for. So, you know, everything. I appreciate that. Thank you. I'm supposed to rub his head. Up, so. No. <laughs> <laughs> I would have to agree. John's the most genuine guy I know. We'd do anything for any of us staying in this room. I've never seen anyone make mistakes like him and bounce back. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, like sheer excitement. I'm here just to see him do something right. He's overcome a lot of adversity in his life. Uh, uh, <laughs> when I met you, I couldn't believe what an incredible, smart, and talented woman had just walked in my, to my life. And there's still times I stop and wonder how on earth I got so lucky. Today is the day all eyes on us. Let's show them how to live in love. John, eight years ago, I was doing personal work around relationships. I wrote some things out that I wanted in a partner and I shared it with a close friend. She suggested that I live these qualities that I wanted in a partner. How could I expect someone to have these qualities when I wasn't practicing them myself? When I got home that evening, I asked God to help me be the woman he would have me be in a relationship. And of course, I prayed for a man to be put in my life. And then I met you. Kim, the first moment I met you, I didn't take anything seriously. I was accustomed to laughing and joking and living life day to day. But something changed when I met you. I know you were apprehensive at first by that amazing Tinder picture from eight plus years ago. But, it, but as fate would have it, we were destined to be together, even if it was from an iPhone glitch, allegedly. <laughs> I love what we have accomplished and built together. I vow to make you my forever adventure buddy. Late nights under the stars, early mornings fishing, camping trips that never go according to plan, and road trips with just one extra stop. I want to share them all with you. 
John, I stand here today before you, God, and our wonderful friends and family, and I vow to forever accept you as you are, to celebrate you and us so big, to grow with you even when it's hard, to do the work that God would have me be, to stay loyal and faithful to you, to do the very best I can. I promise to love you and always be on your side through all the ups and downs. I vow to always be faithful and always be your best friend and your biggest fan. And today and forever, I give you my heart, my soul, and my trust, no matter what our future holds. I vow to love you endlessly for both as for long as we both shall live. I love you and I can't wait to start this new chapter with you. John and Kim. May your marriage be modern enough to deal with these changing times, but traditional enough to last a lifetime. By the power of your loving commitment and the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. John, you may finally kiss your bride. everything I could ask for. He always has my back, no matter how good, bad, or wild ideas I come up with. He's always been supportive. I, in turn, try to do the same for him. It's what brothers are for. When he asked me how I felt about him marrying Kim, I knew this was what he wanted in his heart. I believe Kim sees it too. She has a keen eye, not only through the lens of a camera, but in her real life. spectacular you both look today. I don't think that I've ever seen a better looking couple except for maybe Rich and I. I just wanted to reach out to everybody here. Everyone here has touched our lives. You guys are all the the top special people in our lives. So we had to share this day with you and I super appreciate we we very much appreciate you. <laughs> Still getting used to that. Thank you, thank you, thank you for showing up, making the time for us on our special day. We love you all. Yeah.